Hey, good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody at Revolution Church. How are you? This is Pastor Alpha Hayward, and I'm here in Atlanta, Georgia, with one of my awesome friends and brothers, Mr. Pastor Scott Free. What's happening? Evangelist missionary. You know, how, how, how many times have you been out to Portland, Scott? I lost count. Man. It's probably been at least 15, 20 times. Right. And how it's, many years have we known each other? It's like my second home. We right. met. We met in two thousand and seven. I think eight? it was two thousand seven. Two thousand seven or eight. So that's uh, fifteen years now. Right. Right. Don't and, we, and, it's my brother. Don't we look alike? Come on, my brother from another <laughs> mother. We are in Atlanta, Georgia. We are actually in our office space of the City Takers headquarters right now, and uh, that's the little writing you see. That's our meeting the other day. Man, and God is doing big things out here in Atlanta. Um, it's awesome to see how the Lord is using uh, Pastor Scott and Tammy and the whole crew to Thank do lots guys. of outreach in the city, on the streets, and they even go to other countries, other cities, other urban areas. As a matter of fact, uh, Scott and I will be going together to uh, Fort Myers, Florida. Yeah. And uh, what's happening out there, Scott? We are planting a City Takers mission base to facilitate Man. outreach and urban church planning in Southwest Florida. It's going to be amazing. And guess what? I heard Portland might be next. Come on, Portland could be a good spot. Portland you might be next. You know what I mean? Next. I think you might have some partners. I heard that there's this I, awesome church I out heard. there with some awesome people, awesome body of believers that believe in uh, evangelism. So I, I think, heard the think same we might thing, be able to see that happen. I heard the same thing. So listen, pray for us. Please, God is doing just so much down here in Atlanta. And I want to tell you this as well. Like, we appreciate you guys. Like, you are our second home. Like we wouldn't do a lot of stuff that we do down here in Atlanta if it wasn't for Revolution Church as a whole. Come on, so that's we appreciate awesome. your prayers. We appreciate your support. We appreciate just in, inviting me and the guys like out every year. Like I was just telling Pastor Alpha just yesterday, like my guys talk about the experience that they had in Portland five, six, seven, eight years ago. Like it is changing lives. When That's I get great. to bring people to Portland to experience the culture, experience what God is doing, experience, you know, the city, the coast of Oregon. And sometimes guys who grow up in a certain culture and context in the inner city of Atlanta don't get to experience nothing like that. Right. You know right. what I mean? And it's funny because sometimes when you grow up somewhere, you you get so used to it and yep. it just becomes normal to you. Yeah. And it becomes familiar to you. Right. And you lose the awe and wonder of what it really is. Yep. And so when we get people out of their box here in Atlanta and we bring them to Portland, we bring them to Revolution Church, it really changes their lives. So I just want to say thank you to the whole church. Thank you to the leadership. Thank you to any person who's watching this video right now. Know that what you're doing in Portland is having an impact in the city of Atlanta. And also, Scott, can you tell people, you know, your uh, your uh, social media stuff, your website? And yeah. So it's just citytakers.com is the website. All social media is just at City Takers, and then my personal is at I am Scott Free. And listen, we would love to follow you back, DM us, message us. We'd love to hear from you guys. You guys are family. Yeah, man. ATL is definitely family to us, yeah. and uh, I come out here at least once a year. I, I try to come every year because every time I come here, I get built up. I get encouraged. I get fired up. And every once in a while, you know, the Lord will use Scott to give me a little bit of correction, too, which is good for me. <laughs> and um, but I just wanted to send this video to say I love you guys. And thank you to people like uh, come on, Pastor John Yone. And then today you guys get to hear from Pastor and Dr. William Nione came come all on, the man. way from Nigeria, from the jungle of Nigeria to come and preach to you this morning. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> but uh I want you guys to have a great day, and I, I I just want you guys to know I appreciate you so much because I'm able to be here because of an awesome church that we have in Portland called Revolution Church. And anyone visiting today, I hope you feel welcome. If there wasn't at least five or ten people that that uh, didn't greet you, then let us know, and we'll just go ahead and take care of them. But uh, <laughs> we, we just want you guys to know that we we, we appreciate you coming to the church today. Yeah. Um, as, as we go ahead and close this video, I just want to remind you, pray for Ukraine. You know, pray for Jacoby and his wife out there. They have a powerful missions ministry in Ukraine, and they're in the process of trying to get to safety right now as well. So pray for Ukraine. Pray for our neighborhood right there in Lentz, right in southeast Portland. There's been so many murders, shootings, stabbings that seem to happen on a weekly and sometimes daily basis. So let's just saturate 
the whole area with mm-hmm. prayer. So I would encourage you, even, you know, P- Pastor William, as you come up to preach this morning, lead the church in prayer over the city and over Ukraine, over Nigeria, over Costa Rica. If you guys would take some time and do that, mm-hmm. that would be awesome. So without without further ado, I love you guys. RevolutionChurchPDX.com. Pastor Scott, anything else you want to say before we go? Nah, man, love you. I'm sorry uh, your pastor is down in Atlanta hanging out with us, but it makes a huge impact that you allow him to come down here. Number one, to impact our city, but also so that he can have time to be refreshed, revived, and sent back to you on fire as well. So thank you guys for allowing him to be here. Amen. God bless you guys. And again, thank you. Love you.